fresh clashes in violence hit Manipur. At least five killed and 12 injured in firing by terrorists. Security forces used tear gas and fire from point blank range on those defying the curfew. Union Home Minister Amit Shah to visit Manipur today for three days. And India gets a new parliament. The Prime Minister inaugurates a new parliament building in a grand ceremony. The historic scepter or the Senghor is installed in the Lok Sabha chamber. In his historic speech, the Prime Minister says that we will bear witness to a new dawn. The opposition slams the BJP government, says that the event looks like the Prime Minister's coronation. As we celebrate a new milestone in India's democracy, just two kilometers away from India's new parliament, India's top women wrestlers dragged, pushed and detained for peacefully protesting. They were marching towards the new parliament. The wrestlers were released after more than seven hours. The Delhi police filed an FIR against the protesting wrestlers. The Congress's bit in pole-bound Rajasthan. Congress chief to meet Ashok Gehlot and Sachin Pilot today. This comes ahead of polls. Is it the Congress's attempt for reconciliation? That remains to be seen. And Turkey's Erdogan declares victory in Turkish election. Uh, President Recep Tayyip Erdogan declares a victory in the polls that posed the biggest challenge to his rule in 20 years.